recursive function to implement factorial. Calculating factorial of a number. Base cases when n is equal to 1. If n value is 1 in the sense it has to return 1 as the result because 1 factorial value is 1. Recursive cases factorial function will call by itself with smaller value of n. That is fact of n is equal to n into fact of n minus 1. For example, if I want to find a factorial of 3 in the sense here, n value is 3. n value is 1 in the sense it has to return 1 as the result. Suppose if n value is greater than 1 in the sense what it has to return? Factorial of 3 is n into factorial of n minus 1. n value is 3. 3 into factorial of n minus 1, 3 minus 1 in the sense you will get it as 2. Okay, next this function will call by itself. This is a recursive function. So, here value is 3 into n value is 2 you need to consider for next step. So, when n value is 2 in the sense it is not 1. If it is 1 in the sense directly you will return 1 as the result. So, if it is 2 in the sense it has to return n into factorial of n minus 1. n value is 2, 2 into factorial of n minus 1 in the sense 2 minus 1 in the sense you will get it as 1. With n value 1 the factorial function will call by itself and here n value is 1. When n value is 1 it has to return 1 as the result. Already 3 into 2 into 1. For this function result is 1. When the recursive function meets the base case in the sense it will return directly the result. So here base cases when n value equal to 1. So it will return directly the result 1. So, answer you will get it as 6. Factorial of 3 is, answer is 6 you will get it. So, base cases n is equal to 1. n greater than 1 in the sense that is nothing but recursive case. Recursive case you have to implement with n into factorial of n minus 1.